Health plans are doing a number of things to both reduce the cost of care and improve value. And the most important thing to keep in mind is the two go hand in hand. So in terms of reducing the cost, health plans are working collaboratively with hospitals, with clinicians, and other health care practitioners to change the way payment is structured, to move from a retrospective reimbursement system, fee-for-service, to a more prospective, whether that is bundling, whether it's global budgets, whether it's negotiated budgets, uh, medical homes, negotiating budgets with physician groups, primary care physician groups, and supporting them through uh, care coordination, disease management services. So there's a range of things that health plans are doing on the supply side, on the payment side. Health plans are also doing a number of things, working with those same clinicians and hospitals to make sure in changing and restructuring the payment that we're also looking not only at cost metrics, but quality and performance metrics. And I think that's what makes this whole development so exciting and also enduring and patient-friendly and patient-focused because that's what patients want and purchasers want. They want to know they're getting value for their investment. So what plans are doing is working with physicians, working with hospitals to make sure that they're agreeing on performance metrics so that we know together how to evaluate performance as opposed to either side being unsure or questioning what the metric actually is. And that's what I see as very exciting and a quite an evolutionary stage now. Where we were last year at the leading edge of that. Now you can see that developing all across the country, which I think presents real opportunities for health plans and the provider community working together. So this is a story of collaboration.